Hey, I'm Carrie Milbank, and this is Tennis Week, your source for everything on and off the court in the world of tennis. Four seems to be the magic number for Rafa Nadal. Following his fourth straight Monte Carlo victory last week, he has made it four in a row, winning Barcelona 6-1, 4-6, 6-1 over David Ferrer. To further this streak, he's looking to go for numero cuatro in Rome this week. With this latest victory, the Spaniard improved his record to 103-1 on the dirt and 20-1 in finals. It was an absolute classic matchup at the Outback Champions Series in Boston over the weekend as Johnny Mack took on Pete Sampras in the third round. The two legends battled it out with McEnroe winning in the end 2-6, 7-5, 10-4. He went on to beat Aaron Krikstein in the final, taking home his first OCS title. On the women's side, Vera Zvonareva ended her two-year title drought, defeating Victoria Azarenka 7-6, 6-2 in the Prague Open final. This was the fourth final of the year for the 13th ranked Russian, who was dominant throughout the tournament never losing a set. Maria Sharapova is lashing out at the WTA over a mandatory photo shoot that is scheduled to take place with other top players in Rome this week. Sharapova is upset with the timing of the shoot, saying on her website, mariasharapova.com, I never do shoots before tournaments because they are mentally draining and I just want to focus on my tennis. The WTA is threatening her with a $700,000 fine if she skips the shoot. So she asked her fans to vote on what she should do next with such options as skipping the shoot and taking the fine, taking legal action against the WTA and the most popular option, try to recruit other top players to boycott the shoot. One of those players who's supposed to participate in the shoot is Anna Ivanovich, who graces the cover of the latest Tennis Week magazine with the title, Just How Hot Is She? Inside, Jill Drucker takes an intimate look at the life of tennis's current it girl, from her days growing up in Belgrade to present day, where he describes a top-notch tennis player that still lives a grounded life. You can subscribe to Tennis Week magazine by going to TennisWeek.com. That is all for now, but stay tuned later in the week for the next installment of our Gear Guide. And this one is all about the men. I'm Carrie Milbank. Thanks for watching.